Chinaros can be a difficult place to survive. Luckily, there are some tips and tricks that make it a little easier. And here, I'll share 10 of them. If you like the video, please leave a like or a subscribe. It really helps me out. But without further ado, let's get into the video. And die. Well, that's embarrassing. Just a quick sentence before we begin. As you may or may not know, my videos are constantly being demonetized. So I've just launched a Patreon, which I'll link in the comments and would be really grateful if you could check it out. But now, first tip, never fire your gun without a suppressor, unless you absolutely have to. Daisy has a habit of giving you a gun with a few bullets in it and putting you in a situation where you wanna use it. Don't, you will become swarmed with the infected in seconds and you'll likely attract other players on the hunt from miles away it's not worth it never drink out of water bottles you find you'll probably get ill instead press empty and refill it at a well sealed cans are fine don't ever run along the coast the best loot food and gear is inland your goal from a beginner point is to get there you can usually get what you need in the first town you enter and then head inland learn the basic health system this is one of the biggest killers of new or returning players but it can be helped. There are a plethora of videos online which show you exactly how to prevent and treat every illness and injury there is in day Z and breathe. I even have a video I'll link in the top right that will explain everything you need to know in around five minutes. So five minutes to stop dying of illnesses in day Z. That might be worth your time. Don't punch the infected with anything in your hands. It will become damaged and bandages will lose their disinfected status and you'll likely get ill when you use them. Now Never eat with bloodied hands. Always wash them at a well or natural water sources before you eat. You can also wash them with things like water bottles by just putting them to your hands and clicking wash. Items such as crowbars and knives can open tinned food instead of tin openers, but you get a lot less food than if you were to use an actual tin opener. You can craft gloves or boots using two rags. I can't stress the importance of knowing this. Don't keep food on you. If you find something, eat it. There is no point in keeping it on you. It just takes up weight and space. Food will still drain the same speed. Stay out of the rain. It can lower your clothing's insulation by around 80%, making you cold and ill. You can, however, dry clothing by a fire. Or if you're really wet without a fire, put them in your hands and wring them out, retaining them to damp status, increasing their insulation and making them dry quicker. Vitamins are your friend and will stop you getting basically any illness for five minutes after taking one. Then you can pop another right after and do the exact same but never stack them. Take one at a time, wait for the icon to disappear, then take another. However, you can pair them up with other treatments such as tetracycline speeding up recovery speed. So you can take one tetracycline and one vitamin and then five minutes later repeat. But if you can't find any of these things and you want to find the town or just stop getting lost, all you have to do is click here and I'll tell you everything you need to know about finding your way around without the need for a map. And as always, until next time.